Welcome to Railway Empire 2 Scenarios Playthrough. All right, hi, this is Atticon, and welcome to the start of a brand new, never before seen series here on the channel. We're going to play through the Railway Empire 2 scenarios. And we're just going to, our intent is to play through them 1 through 14 as they come up. We're going to start on number one, logically enough. We're in the East Coast. We start in Chicago in 1880. We got about a million square miles of land here. There are 37 cities and 104 businesses scattered around. And it's considered normal difficulty. It's called the Indianapolis race. Chicago, 1880. During a dinner after a railroad convention in front of all the guests, you made a bet with Madame Ward. Who will be the first to connect the Great Lakes to Jacksonville, Florida? You start from Chicago, Madame Ward from Toledo. Everyone has to connect certain cities and fulfill certain other tasks. Whoever completes all the objectives first wins the race and gets each other's route. Let's see what we got. Now we get to pick our character. I'm not going to go through all the characters in detail, just to say that from what I can see first glance, the general and the engineer are both pretty strong. The gangster is extremely weak. The entrepreneur is pretty good. Yeah, she, yeah, she's pretty good. And the professor is kind of weak with this, kind of meh. You could get by with him because of the cheap trains, but not. Nah, I, I think the general and the engineer are probably the two the two I like best right, right now. That could change tomorrow. So let's just use the general. We got, uh, this is all standard setup. We got $2 million, one regular uh, competitor. That will be Madam Ward the lady and let's go good morning this is going to be an interesting competition that you have started I'm not quite sure why you got involved in this bet but anyway the additional connections certainly won't hurt our country I have been appointed as a referee, and your mission will be to connect Chicago with Jacksonville, Florida, as quickly as possible. Your competitor has a similar endeavor, only that she starts from Toledo. Let's go then. Ladies and gentlemen, start the engines. The race is divided into several stages. You must always complete the tasks of one stage before the next stage, along with the next region, is unlocked. Okay, I think we got lucky on our research tree this time. It's different every time, but we have everything researched up to our current age, 1880. So we can get this reduced maintenance right here, or we can hold off for the speed. I, I had nothing wrong with reduced maintenance. Okay. All right, let's see what they want us to do. Connect Indy to Chicago, Five rural businesses and 80,000 citizens. And Chicago's 18. They're all about the same size. It's going to take five. We're going to need five cities, five businesses to knock these off. And note that Madam Ward can be faster at fulfilling her task than the time given to you. If she finishes first, you lose. So, and I don't know if that means if she finishes any leg faster than you, you lose. I think it means if she finishes the whole thing before us. But... Be as it may, they're telling us we don't have till 1880. We've got to go faster than that. And of course we will anyway. And those of you who are veterans know this is going to get done on the first day. There's no way we're going to, these are just little connection tasks. Of course we're going to do them right away. Now I'm trying to decide what strategy to use. I said in a community post I would use the same strategy as, well, you, you wouldn't know what it was. The same strategy as the uh, video I deleted. That's partially true, I think. I uh, get bored doing it that way, so go do something slightly different, but more or less the same. So let me think about this. Yeah, I, I think we're going to use a single station setup because this this particular scenario, you, you want to grow, but you don't have to grow. It's not a giant city building kind of a thing. Let's go here. Let's get that connection Indianapolis to Chicago. That's an easy one to knock off our list. Uh, come down off the mountain.
I don't like where we have Indianapolis. See how it was going over that contour? That's no good. Made the grade coming out of there way too, too steep. Unnecessarily steep. Let's get it back here. Much better. Very good. You have completed the first task. How are we going to do this? I think we're going to double. Ah. One to double track. Well, you got to double track it right then, or they don't give you a second chance, do they? All right, let's double track that. Let's connect. Island in here. Now we're going to double track it. Shoot. I think we'll just have one, yeah, one, one platform is plenty for that one. And then, And we're going to need one more, so we'll have to buy our way into one of these. We'll go up here to Madison. the second task I'm right behind you don't think you're safe from me oh, we got our five real businesses let's let's get that done I think at first this is just going to be a throwaway to get it done before we start running the clock. That's two. That's four. Five. But I'm right behind you. You have completed all the objectives of the first stage. Now the next stage, along with the next region, will be unlocked. All right, so new tasks. Deliver corn to Chicago, 40,000 in Louisville, and 250 passengers from Chicago to Louisville. All right, so we're going to... Delete all these freight connections that we made. 
We'll connect Louisville. A train station in this city? Have you thought this through? Make sure it's maxing out. Double track that. Let's see what we got here. All right, let's start uh, making some lines. Here to here, express. Oh, I didn't go through the trains, but the De Glenn is a new express. It's the latest and greatest. We'll be using it. And there's one called the PRR D12, I think it is which is a mixed use. We're going to use it for all our freight. One, two, three, seven days. That's pretty good. Now I'll go here, to here, to here, to here. No, wait, wait. You know what? I think I'm going to make all of these lines. Uh, uh, yes, just get out of that. I want to go back to this one here. I want, I want them all to kind of go to three cities. One, two, three, four, like that. Sixteen days. That one train can cover. Put a couple on it to start with. And where would it have a problem with track directions? Right here, I guess. Okay, that's that's one line. So we got one here. Let's do one here. couple of trains on it and there again we've got track direction right down here I guess and I think there's yeah they're hard to see but yes there are switches okay so we've got one like this one like this I kind of like that. Well, we're out of money. Let's go get some more money. I'd actually like to have Grand Rapids join the party. Went like this, follow the gradients.
Okay. Three degrees right here. Two degrees, two, max, 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 that looks pretty good. Alright, let's let these run, see if we can make any money. Task completed. Okay, she just finished her first task. Okay, I definitely want to get some track going like this. Ooh, 10 percent what in the world what was that that was weird Carried a few down there. Second task fulfilled. So you now this Rock Island will go to Louisville via Chicago and Indianapolis via Chicago. I expect these guys will go to Louisville via Chicago. Yes, they will. And should be the same here. So we should be getting plenty of passengers going to, oh, we don't have this train up yet. Nobody's going anywhere here. One, two, three, four. Let me get one on it. Got a couple on that. Okay, now hopefully this will give us an engine of some sorts.
Okay, let's knock off a task real fast. Let's go here. There's the PRR we're talking about. We're going to take corn up to Chicago and bring some um, cloth back down to Louisville to start with. Okay, I'll knock off that one task. We get corn sugar in there and we'll have we'll have Louisville growing. So let's uh, look at look into that. Uh, let's see. Okay, here goes a task. Well, look who's a nose ahead. Okay, if we put uh, if we put a supply tower right in here, it's going to pick up every line we have so far. Now, let's start getting freight into Louisville.
Uh, not quite long enough. Okay, we're doing great on that, not surprising. We've got it set up for that, but and we've got this one, and we really gotta get Louisville growing. Which shouldn't be that difficult, honestly. some lines making some money. And I guess my question is, where is that, uh, this one? Rail line incomplete. What does that mean? Where <laughs> Oh, this this is not there anymore. We'll just confirm it like that. Let it go into Louisville and then down to the corn. Well, it's already down there. Doggone it. It'll drop that off and it'll start running corn. Oh, and then we're going to go ahead and put this, build that line. Okay, now he's, now we can edit his line and go here and here and here and here. So he's going to bring corn and sugar and grain to to Louisville. We'll move corn down last since we just did it and confirm that. And what doesn't he like? Uh, well, we have single track here and here. He doesn't like that. I think we have signals here. We do. And he can get over it. Just go. Okay. 
pretty good quarter. That's our first quarter. Oh, that's very good. All right, good. That's a very good first quarter. Now I'm trying to decide if I really want to go with multiple stations here to maximize the profit off of the passenger lines. In other words, all these stations that are out here, well, we're not going to use warehouses, so we really, we really don't have to. Okay, here's, here's what we'll do. We'll put repairs in Louisville. We're going to set our repairs to 100%. And we'll put repairs in Chicago because every passenger train gets to Chicago. All the lines we have set up end up in Chicago. And we're also going to bump this out. Give ourselves more options in Chicago. Well... Hopefully you won't make any careless mistakes at this speed. We got our 250 passengers, I'm assuming. Are we growing in Louisville yet? We don't know yet. Okay. I want to set this up with. Uh, uh, shoot, shoot, shoot. I'm going to delete, delete this. I'm going to, I want this to have a. four lanes open to it and then we're going to need, need to reconnect this uh, this guy there we go okay all right Louisville is growing and what we don't have is freight running through here would like to have even if we have one station I'd kind of like to have the freight running on a separate line but you know what I'm not going to worry about it I, I think we're going to just do here 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 a freight line It'll just take one train to move the beer and the cloth basically down to Louisville. That's, that's its main job in life. Let's get beer and cloth to Louisville. And you can take meat back up to the other two. It's fine. And as soon as we have some money, we're going to throw wood on our line that's feeding Louisville. And Louisville is just growing. It's got corn on the way. It'll have everything except wood. And once we have a little money, we'll add wood here and get that going as well. And we got a little money. And hmm. let's go down here like this, I think. 
run with the contours and then come across like this and join in to that track. Okay, and then that one line we have. We're going to edit this and say, okay, you do that, you do all that, then you go up here and you get wood, and you come back here. And confirm. Okay, let's, uh, let's wrap this one up right here. We've got a uh, pre pretty good start. We've got a little passenger mail economic engine, which we can build up a lot by putting in our special buildings and getting the bonuses. Um, that'll be priority next time. We'll, we can get Louisville up to 100% growth, and then we'll add in the growth so that we can grow Chicago and Indianapolis as well, which will only increase the uh, passenger flow. We'll make all that better. And uh, we'll take care of all that next episode. I hope you enjoyed that. I hope it'll help you become a better player. I hope you'll like, comment, and subscribe, and join us for more Railway Empire 2 videos. Thank you.